Welcome back to Whisper Gaming ASMR. And if you're new here, I upload two versions of all my videos. One with gameplay audio and one without. So check the video title to see which one you're watching. And if you'd prefer to watch the other version, it is linked at the top of my video description. Now that that's out of the way, today we will be playing Baldur's Gate 3. The last video I went through character customization. I actually just went back through and redid it. I made a couple changes and changed my character's name from Toph to Toffee. I didn't really like the sound of Toph, but I wasn't original enough to come up with something completely new since there is no random name generator. But anyway, I don't exactly know how this game works, so hopefully it walks you through a lot of stuff. Okay, so it looks like I click to move around. Let's see if there's people in these mind flare pods. Looks like there's someone in... Oh no, there's no one in that one either. I 
don't know how far we're going to get in this video again. I want to try to keep it to around 30 minutes. So, okay, we have these tips over here. I'm just noticing all the middle mouse buttons zoom in and out. You can also move the camera with WASD and rotate with Q and E. Dice. This game uses dice to determine outcomes. Okay, so it's like Dungeons and Dragons in that aspect. Use home. I've never used the home button on my keyboard ever. You can also hold the left mouse button or double click on your character's bottom left portrait to do the same. Hold the alt to highlight objects you can interact with. Okay, that's nothing here, but... And jump. Okay. Oh, crap. How did I miss her? some demons behind her. Transform, what do you mean? Bard imps, are we in hell? You look nothing like the poems describe. That's funny. Can I ask more than one question? I wonder. Like, will I be able to come back and ask these clarifying questions if I do this one? Transform. What do you mean? seem uh, concerned at all. We're turning into mind players. There must be something we can do. Does my character not talk? Is the helm our way out of here? in this game. I also did not select a difficulty. I don't know if that's even a thing or if there's just one difficulty in this game. But I remember combat turns. Combat happens in turns. Each turn you can take one action and one bonus action. You can also move. A roll of the die decides turn order. This is called initiative and is influenced by your dexterity. Your actions are identified by the dot icons. Click this icon to show your available actions. Bonus actions are smaller or quicker actions you can perform on top of your regular actions. They are identified by the triangle icon. Click the icons to show your bonus actions. Movement bar shows how much distance you can cover during your turn. Okay, I can't move very far. I can throw an item, I can sprint, I can disengage, I can main, I can ranged attack, piercing strike.
piercing shot. Okay, I think. Unleash a striking and impart disadvantage. Let's try this. actions. actions. Second wind, draw on your stamina to heal yourself. Hide. Maybe it wasn't smart to group up like that, but whatever. Surprisingly adequate. I think my character is more than surprisingly adequate. Okay, let's loot these baddies. One to six. How do I see what she's working with? Okay. Yeah, 
it's probably not worth it. What is that sound? Mysterious liquid restoration. Suicide after I healed her. Nice five gold. Why is there no way to look up? That's... Also, is this the way we're supposed to be going? Let's check down here a little more first, I guess. Wasted. Did this not like trigger combat? to the bottom. 
Hope I don't burn. Okay. Should we be fighting these people? Oh shit. actions. No, let's not waste it. Okay, if you missed that one. Okay, 
let's loot all this stuff. At least now I can go back and kill those cultists instead of healing them. Sweet. That's not as good. Oh, a ring. Okay, maybe it is good that I, I died. Don't know if that does anything, but. Oh, 
thoughts going like, should I kill these things or... So they think we're on their team because we have the things in our brains, right? Is that what's going on? Jesus Christ. That's not a good chance. Shit. Weakening strike. I'm like nervous. Gaping wound. Three to eight. Night. Ah, oh, it's safe, motherfucker. Okay, what do I have for bonus actions? Throwing it off balance. Let's see how this goes. Nice. Okay, and then <laughs> let's get the hell out of Dodge. Let's back up. Ah, shit. Four to thirteen, how much? 
my child has sex. in the same party, they're next to each other, can act at the same time. Nice. that healing thing. And then we will call it there. The, the combat is pretty interesting in this game. It's going to take some getting used to, but I like it so far. Nice. Okay, well, we're about at 40 minutes, so we will call it there. And how do you say it? Lazel. Yeah. So in the next video, we will continue Tavi and Lazel's journey as we try to find our way off this Mind Flayer ship. But I appreciate you spending your time with me. Sorry about that stupid way of dying and having to backtrack, but hopefully it wasn't too painful for you. And uh, as always, if you're trying to fall asleep, I hope you're not hearing this. And I hope you'll come back to join me in the next one. Goodbye and good night.